hey clashers and viewers of youtube uh, today it's time to clash with sp jack and today i'm going to show you how to get into infinite tower in clash royale now infinite tower is one of the overpowered defensive troop that actually take golem out of the way so one of the few tricks you can use to counter inferno tower if you're facing one so let's view some first of all lightning so let's slow motion this kind of attacks right so let's do a slow motion here you can see lightning is one of the versatile unit which could damage the tower as well as the tower as well as the crown tower that's what helped the lightning then you can arrow it if the remaining health is left over here but this time the inferno towers was low level so it was done very easily so next we'll move on to rocket rocket is one of the one counter unit you can use it but rocket just does attack on single unit so it may not be effective against uh, as may affect you as lighting spell but yes rocket can take the inferno tower very easily next one using the hog rider and the melee units first of all spreading the melee units from the bridge you will see the video right now okay you can see right now because spreading the melee unit first then placing the hog rider into the front of the bridge so that the hog rider so that the inferno tower gets focused on the melee unit and your hog rider can actually take the hits from the inferno tower and can directly move on towards the tower at this position you can see the hog inferno tower was just focused on the melee goblins and skeleton army so the hog rider moved away very easily and took the inferno and dealing no great damage towards the hog moving on to the next attack so let's do some live battle sorry for the next attack scene let's do some live battle over here and we can check how the deck works against inferno tower so here we have the rocket lighting spell deck with using the hog rider so spreading the melee units first i am going to take this rocket and take the inferno out of the uh, base and now we can spread our archers in the front to take the towers a few hit ahead and actually archers is one of the great unit in clash royale to counter against any trigon musketeer giants menka and everything but the small skeleton army can take even very large units so it's impossible to take them out if you don't have arrows with you or wizards or any splash kind of damage so take let's start bring the hog rider now you guys can see i spread the hog rider with the help of melee goblins because this melee goblin would push the hog rider very very fast even a second can help you to win the matches now you can see we I have taken the one tower very easily because this many goblins are so overpowered with hog rider if hog rider is spread ahead so if hog rider is ahead melee goblins are distracted the tower is focused on the hog rider and the melee goblins can come from the back and put two counts damage towards the crown tower now you can see is placing the hog rider again i will uh, lighting i will use lighting spell this time because lighting can do towers damage to what's up inferno tower as well as the crown tower so uh, lighting spell is one of the versatile unit i was trying to rocket this because the but the inferno get out very easily now we're trying to do the same with the goblins and the hog rider because this is one of the great strategy i'm using it very well you can use it for arena 4 or arena 3 maybe because in bigger arenas you can use you can't use this type of strategy this was a friendly battle to show you guys this strategy works if you are in arena 4 or 3 right now i'm using this rocket again to take this inferno out from this base so that i could actually push towards this crown towers as well as the middle tower to take him out very easily right now i'm saying well played you did the same what i'm saying about you okay now you're saying thanks okay doesn't matter so i'm spinning the bomb now i would like to talk about my patreon account which i have provided the link down into the description now i have prepared a patreon account actually what is patreon account you if you become my patreon for example some or someone has become my patreon he will get an advantage to my channel for example he wants an emergency video regarding clash of clan and clash royal i post the video as per the demand of his <coughs> as per his demand so it's just a one dollar patreon account you can dollar donate me one dollar even donating one dollar will give you an extra access to my channel i will post videos as per your suggestion as per your comments as per your views and reviews so hope you become my patreon because this is one of the great way to get view content more content and i will do a shout out on to this saturday for those who are becoming an active subscriber of me for example uh, to become a shout out winner you have to comment down below hashtag shout out me for more you can uh, connect comment down below i will ask uh, answer your all questions thanks for watching this video don't forget to like subscribe and comment this is epic life clasher i'll bring more content thank you